News a coyote attacks and injures a small dog in a Northfield backyard. Tonight, the dog's owner wants this horrible incident caught on video to be a lesson for others. CBS 2's Charlie DeMar explains from Northfield. It's Wednesday morning and Boozer has got to go. But as he looks for the perfect spot in his Northfield backyard, a coyote from the distance approaches and attacks. When you run into work and you let your dog out for 30 seconds, before you go, you know, you think that's going to be okay. Owner Barnaby Dinges told me over the phone that the terrier has been part of the family for about 15 years. But I really want people to see what can happen in like five seconds. In those few terrifying seconds, Boozer gets dragged through the backyard until Barnaby's wife chases the coyote off. I, mean, I was very proud of Boozer and how he sort of handled it and defended himself. And then my my Wonder Woman wife came out and saved the day, as she always does. Given the fact that it is breeding season, it was probably marking its territory. Lambrini Lukitas speaking on behalf of a wildlife biologist with the Forest Preserves of Cook County who reviewed the video. If the animal did really want to, you know, to kill the dog, it probably would have been able to. Tonight, Boozer is battered but alive. Staples in his head, bite marks all over and an injured eye. You do not want anyone who's got a pet they love to just let their guard down. They'll, they'll regret it, and you know, we got lucky. And coyotes generally do not pose a threat to people, but this is a good reminder to keep a leash on your dog when you can. Also, have a secure lid on your trash can so you aren't luring those coyotes to your backyard with food. We are live tonight in Northfield. Charlie DeMar, CBS2 News, Robin Erica. Yeah, incredible video there, Charlie. Thank you.